Welcome to the official Windows 8 channel and today is a little video showing you how to actually um, activate or deactivate open apps. Now every time you click on an app in Windows 8 even if you come back to the start menu by using the Windows key that app is actually still running in the background and if you open lots of apps what happens is that you will eventually get a lot and a lot of the little apps in the background running doing some task or doing something and that can slow down your computer of course if you have too many of them and it also can be a little um, mix up you know if too many apps are open sometimes you'll get into an app that you don't want to go to and say whoa why is it switching when I choose the Windows key, it's not switching to the good app, it's switching to an other app. Or uh, Usually what happens is that the Windows key will bring you back to the last app that you used. For example, I just looked at the weather, and so it brought me back to my weather app. And if I click back and go back to the start menu, the start screen. So if you swipe from left to right on a touch device, or if you just put your little arrow just point your arrow into the top left corner of your screen you will see that the main app that you used last is there but you see also that if you lower that little oops sorry if you lower your arrow you will see that all the apps show up and they are there running doing their little thing so you can see that, for example, I have my calendar open, the desktop version of Explorer is open, the Internet Explorer Windows 8 version is open, the PC settings menu is open, my weather tile is open, my mail app is open. So it's lots of little apps actually running. So you might not want to have all of those. And the more you'll open apps, the more this list will be long. So there's a way of actually closing down the apps that you know you'll not use again or not use for a while so all you have to do is simply go and open those apps so like I said if you have a touch screen you swipe from left to right uh, starting at the left of your screen you'll have those uh, tabs opening up of uh, all the little apps and of, of course you can go to the lower or upper right uh, left corner sorry on the left side of your screen you'll go to the upper or lower left corner and then you'll go down with your uh, little your pointer and it will gonna show up or if you're on the left for example at the bottom you just go up with your pointer and they show up all you have to do to close them up is click just go onto the tile you want to close right click on it and choose close once again, right click every app that you don't want to have open at this time. And you got to be careful because I've noticed, for example, that if you're in Internet Explorer and, um, for example, you're looking at a YouTube video, I've noticed that if you look at the miniature tab at the left here, you'll see that the video is actually... Um, it, will pause but if you look at the miniature it's gonna show you that it's still going on so you know it's nice but uh, you might not always want to have all of those little apps running in the background so by going to the left side you can close all of those little apps so here I have no more apps that are open but of course if you click on something for example go back to the desktop here and I'll close Internet Explorer desktop version. Here I am on the desktop. If I click the Windows key to go back to the start screen, if I go to the left corner, you see that my desktop is running. It is an app. So every app that you use uh, will actually generate such a uh, little app miniature on the left side of your screen. Now it's fun though because what's cool about it is the fact that those miniature apps on the left side of your screen lets you go from one app to the other so if I want to go to the desktop I can click directly here and I can actually go back here and click 
to the Explorer tab and switch tabs or apps, sorry, not tabs, switch apps inside of Windows 8. So this is a great way if you have three, four, five different little applications you're actually going through all the time. It's cool because they're available all the time from the left corners and all you have to do is click on the one that you want to go to and you switch immediately to that app. So it is a good feature though because it lets you switch between all the different applications that are working in your computer and it's really fast. So that is a good, good way of doing things. But like I said, having too many is also a little drawback because it means that lots of these apps are not running. So it can slow down a computer, especially if you're installed Windows 8 in an old computer. I think that um, managing your open apps might be a good idea. So all you have to do, like I said, corners on the left side, then you go down and you right click on an app and just choose close and it will close that app. So this was the video showing you how to close and um, explaining a little why it's also useful to have these uh, apps that are running and how to close them when you want to close all the running apps on your computer. So if you enjoyed this video, click the subscribe button at the top of the screen. You'll be informed of all the videos we put online. If you have any comments, questions, maybe a request of a video you'd like to see, let us know. We'll try to put it online for you. And I uh, hope you enjoy these videos on the official Windows 8 channel. And uh, if you like our videos, click the little like button on the bottom so that we uh, get better ratings on the internet. So uh, thanks for watching. Hope you come back often. Bye-bye.